have a couple more weeks to donate to the Seven Cares Coat Drive through November 20th. Local Fred Meyer stores are accepting coat donations for the Salvation Army. Now keep in mind, there have been some changes uh, because of the coronavirus pandemic, but I recently talked to Jeffrey Temple with Fred Meyer and Tom Stambaugh with the Salvation Army about how you can get involved and also double your donation. Check this out. Jeffrey and Major Tom, it's great to have both of you joining me this morning. And I just wanna say thank you so much for your continued partnership with KTV and our Seven Cares Coat Drive. Uh, let's talk about Fred Meyer's involvement. This year, I know it's a little bit different. So give us the update, Jeffrey. Sure, well, we're really excited once again to be partnered with Seven Cares and Salvation Army. Um, it's, it's a great tradition and it's a great opportunity to connect the dots between the community and the solution. And so, you know, we recognize that we're heading into some cold weather here and uh, all members of the family are going to need some coats to stay warm. And so, um, you know, this year we're going to have bins out uh, for donations. Customers can come in and buy a coat and just drop it off. We want to keep it as simple as possible. We also want to make sure that we're prioritizing safety. We recognize that we're in the middle of the pandemic. And so we want to make sure that, you know, our customers who are participating, our associates, and of course the beneficiaries of, of Salvation Army, um, all, all have, um, you know, the opportunity to be safe. And so that's why we're, we're limiting to, you know, new coats to be, to be um, donated uh, for, for beneficiaries this year. Okay, so new coats. And also when people donate a new coat, it's actually double because Fred Myers is matching. Tell us about that. Absolutely. So we recognize that there's a lot of hardship out there. People have really endured some tough times and are still enduring some tough times. And so the need is greater than it's ever been, arguably. And so we know that um, there's there's um, an opportunity to not just be in the community, but be part of the community in this way. And so we are actually going to match the first 7,000 coats donated. We really want to incentivize folks to participate, but we also want to make sure that we're putting some skin in the game as well to make sure that we're doing all that we can to help support you know, the people and the community. And by the way, every coat that's donated stays local to help people in the community. Wonderful. So we know that that donation that we're giving is going to somebody that we may even know or may even be in our own backyard or at least someone that we know needs help, like you mentioned, here at home. And and give us a better idea too, Major, of who these coats will be going to. Who are these individuals that need, that need this warmth this time of year? Right. Well, last year in Ada County alone, the Salvation Army provided uh, 699 kids with a brand new coat for this last year in 2019. This is prior to our, our arrival, but this year we're seeing with the colder temperatures and even with COVID and, and going to school and different different levels of activity, we're still probably gonna see a need of, of that about that much, about 700 to 600 kids that might need a new coat uh, for, for, the, for this cold you know, weather season. And to learn more about this year's Seven Care Coat Drive or where you can buy and donate the coats, just head on over to the community section of ktvb.com. We certainly would love for you to get involved.